Georgie and this is Toby uh, from Tummy and Gummy and that's Leo. Um, so today I thought we'd do a little um, face wash for Toby. So he gets these pretty regularly. Um, it sort of depends on you know what he's wearing, what he's been like, if he gets any chance to come out and groom himself. Um, and he's doing pretty well actually. He hasn't had the cone on much lately. <laughs> um, so his face is pretty clean but we're still going to give him a little face wash just to help it keep that way and he's not too happy about it is he come on okay so we're going to undress him up over the head good boy there we go okay so here i've got some body wipes and that's what i'm going to do first and he doesn't like them so i'm just going to give him a little bit of a wash um where he's not been able to groom himself because of the shirt come on good boy well done that belly yeah good boy okay there we go all cleaned up and now we're going to wash his face so we'll do the eyes first i've got a bowl of warm water here just dip the cotton ball on here we go and wipe it down his eyes not a fan of you okay and when we do that we'll try to pull his eyes back um so because of his loose skin he's prone to a bit of um ingrown hair around his eyes so we just try to get those eyelashes out don't we yes keep that nice and clean um and that can cause his eyes to get a bit dribbly as well when that flows up a bit we go and the next one so do two separate eyes just a good habit to get into they're not goopy now but while they are goopy we don't want to spread that do we huh good boy no no hmm. nice gentle grip yes let's keep you where you are hmm? there we go good boy okay so this is the bit he's going to hate the most. So I've got some hippie scrub because that acts as a nice little soap to help clean his chops. Um, so under his chin and around his neck can get very nasty just because, you know. Oh, <gasps> good boy. It's almost over. There's a lot of skin there, isn't there? So we just try to get up under there. There we go. Lift your head up. Come on. Who's a good boy? Yes. Good boy. Okay. Get that neck. I don't know if you can see any of the goop there. You're still doing pretty good, aren't you? Yes. Well done. Oh, you're so handsome. There we go. Jowls, nice and clean. Beautiful. Okay. We're going to wipe around the rest of his head while we're here. I know. Okay, and now we're going to redress him um, because he does have a bit of an injury on his arm and we don't want him to get to that. So, a nice shirt on you today. Sometimes it doesn't hurt to look snazzy, does it? Oh, look, Mr. Moody. There we go. And the other arm, come on. Good boy. Slip that in. There we go. And we got buttons. Come on, buttons on this shirt. I'll just do a middle button. Okay. Come on. Well done. <sighs> oh, there we go. Do you want a couple dreamies? <sighs> I know. There you go. There you go. We're not going to put that back on for now, are we? Because you've been a good boy. A bit of time out. Well done. There we go. I'll take that last button, so you take those two. I'm going to do a button here. 
flopping about on your legs. Huh? Okay, so as you can see, Toby is nice and handsome and dressed. <sighs> um, pretty happy with his little snacks now. So that would be Toby done for the day. Um, and if he continues on the way he is, his eyes are nice and dry, his face is nice and clean. Um, he's not had to be in the collar too much, so he can groom himself quite a lot. Um, he shouldn't need another face wash for maybe two to three days. Um, even a little bit longer if he is very good. Huh? Good boy. And now he's going to be just a tiny bit mad at me, but not too mad that he doesn't want the snacks. Show me a pretty face. Come on. There we go. Look at you. And nice and clean. You're just going to dry your chops now. Good boy. Well done. Huh? And that's Toby all set up for the day. Yes. So if you enjoyed seeing Toby and uh, you'd like some more videos, make sure you subscribe. Um, we're hoping to do some more. If there's anything that you would like to know about Toby and Leo and um, caring for a cat with Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, then please let us know. Thank you.